Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the vlog and today we're gonna have a completely different vlog. I normally all my vlogs are cars or like going to car events and doing stuff, but today's vlog is completely different. We're getting a tattoo today. That's crazy. I'm getting a tattoo and you guys know I love anime. So we're getting an anime tattoo today and this is like I, get, I don't know if they're new or not. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if this is a new tattoo shop or not, but they basically specialize in anime tattoos. I already have a couple of anime tattoos on my legs. And today I was like, YOLO, let's just go get an anime tattoo. Let's run it. And that is exactly what we're doing. So um, I'm a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. Anytime I go to a new shop where I haven't gotten a tattoo before, I'm always nervous because this is something you're gonna get on your body forever. Are they gonna be good? Are they not gonna be good? Is it gonna... How's it gonna turn out? So I'm a little nervous, and also my hands are getting a little clammy. I I I like tattoos. They feel good. I don't know how anyone else feels, but I personally feel and think that tattoos feel good. Yeah, they they're, they're painful, but I kind of like the pain. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm cuckoo. I don't know. For anyone else, I guess tattoos. I don't know. Maybe you guys can comment down below if I'm crazy or not. But now my hands are getting a little clammy because I'm getting them. It's getting it on my leg, and it's like. A tender spot in my leg so it might be painful it might not be painful but it's gonna be a pretty decent sized tattoo so we might be here a while but when we show up to the shop I'm gonna show you guys the shop where it's at the different at tattoos that they do there because they literally specialize in nothing but anime all right so we just made it to the place it's called King's Inc here in Ontario please appointment only but now we're about to see what this place is about. And here's gonna be our tattoo artist for the day. Most of you guys know this is Paola. We'll leave her Instagram right here. Oh, so this is yeah. your this is your shop, yeah, right? Yeah, it's me and my husband's tattoo shop. We're an all anime tattoo shop. And you guys can kind of see, you got a lot of anime things all over the place. It's a whole anime. It's, this is Dweeb Central. And you know what, with Dweeb Central, I feel just at home, okay? If you didn't get bullied in middle school for liking anime, you ain't not an OG. And this is where all the art happens. Damn, look at this. This place is actually sick. You got One Piece, you got more Kakashi, Jujutsu Kaisen, Demon Slayer. You got all the artists over here, this is pretty sick. So we got some of the artists here. Look, we already got some some action going down in here. Yeah, man, so, oh, she has a little bit of everything on there. This is sick. Gojo Sensei, this. Ooh, we got some Demon Slayer up in there, okay. Oh, this is gnarly, that's sick, dude. Best of day in oh, no yeah, way. Sick. What are you doing over here? Dessert. Ooh. Sick. How you doing, brother? What do we got over here? Ooh. Some more jujutsu. Sick. You guys kind of got a rundown of all the artists that are here at King's Inc. And, I mean, you guys saw the work is actually pretty badass. So, like I said, I was a little nervous. I've never been here before, but, I mean... Looking at the work that they're doing, this place actually looks pretty badass. Yeah, this is where we belong. And Des <laughs> might be looking at oh. a future tattoo. Oh, for sure. For you know sure. what I'm saying? This yeah. might have to have a little, this is where a we're little something here. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We're coming. All right, guys, it's going down. Follow the shaving me. <laughs> so I guess this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do thigh, and it's uh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. Like I said, it's always scary when you first start getting a tattoo because I already know what the pain is, but you're like, bruh. Like it's gonna go down. And we're gonna go a little bit bigger than we had originally expected, so. Go big or go home. Huh? Yeah, literally, go big or go home. I love that. It's super Alright, this is final form. Dude, this thing's fucking huge. Dude, this tattoo's about to be so big, but. Yeah. It looks badass. Look at that. This aspect kind of like of him like eating it is super nice. I'm just, I'm just I, don't, for I this. don't know what we'll do eventually here. This will hurt like a muff, but put my name right here. You know I mean? Hey yo man, we gotta <laughs> <laughs> yo, we gotta control this man, bro. This man's horny dude. Yeah, so I was He's horny on this Friday. <laughs> like I said, there's something painful about tattoos, but calming and relieving at the same time. It hurts, but it feels good. I don't know if I'm weird.
done. Yo, we got the lines. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, look, I'm not even gonna cap. I'm pretty good with pain, but that shit was low key painful, man. That last thing that she was hitting in here was painful. But we're in. We're in. This is the line. The, the lines are done, bro. She's fucking killing it. Alrighty, so we just finished for the day. I haven't even seen this final product, so I'm excited to see what we got. I know she did some shading in there. We got some color in there. I'm excited to see. Bro, that looks badass, yo. Sheesh, do you see this? Bro, this is badass. And like you can say, like I said, she did some of the shading just so we can kind of see what it's gonna look like overall. And that looks badass, bro. <laughs> this is sick. Car shows. I'm gonna have to start bringing shorts to show all of you guys. Booty yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, He's gonna wear my shorts. <laughs> He's gonna wear skirts. <laughs> Paula, thank you so much. Uh, this is the first session, right? How many more sessions do you think, I think we got? Like more if you can handle it. If you so can I, get here early. Yeah. <laughs> I know, dude. There was a lot of traffic today. It's not my fault. I did get here a little late, but I told Paula. Before we take off, though, I want to show you like some of the finished products from today. Look at this. Damn, sick. Look at what finished product. That thing looks badass. Now we showed some of her leg earlier, but look at this. Full Demon Slayer out, dude. You guys know Demon Slayer is like literally top three animes for me right now. You got Rengoku, you got Tanjiro, you got a little bit of everything in there. Woo, this is sick, bro. It's coming out badass. Yo, what's up, guys? It is day two, honestly. Okay, don't judge me. I'm gonna get a little naked out here. This is what the tattoo's looking like today. Oh God, it's a bloody mess. It's hurting, I'm not gonna lie. It doesn't hurt bad, but it's hurting today. However, we're gonna finish today's vlog by doing an installation on none of my cars, none of my parents' cars, none of Mikey's cars, on Shirley's car. And Shirley's car looks really sick. There's not much that needs to be done to this car because I honestly think this car looks badass. I mean, we probably could add like carbon accents to this, like a carbon hood, some other carbon stuff, but this car overall looks already pretty cool. However, I do not agree with this. You can't have some nice ass wheels with your rotors looking like that. Look how, oh, that's crusty. That's crusty and dusty. Obviously, it's a base model Corolla. She doesn't need a big brake kit, but what she does need is some nice looking rotors to complement her wheels. And that is exactly what we got her. We're gonna surprise her with some drilled and slotted rotors from R1 Concepts. Huge shout out to R1 Concepts. They sent over a nice little goodie box for her. Shirley doesn't know that we're doing this just yet, so we are gonna bring her out here, surprise her with a nice little box, let her open it, and we're also gonna make her install the, the rotors on her own car. This way she could get down and dirty and say that she's actually worked and built her own car. Walk forward, <laughs> walk forward, turn a little bit more. Okay, stop, now take the blindfold off. <laughs> Whee! Here's the bubble wrap. Ah! <laughs> Do you know what it is? It's brake pads. Yeah, brake pads. And rotors. Yeah, yeah, some rotor. Yeah, drill the slider ah! rotor. She put her booty. All right, Letty Shirley Boo, <laughs> work on her car. Let's go. <laughs> She's a pro now. Look at her. Jeez. No gloves or anything either. Come on. Yeah, you go. Now you yep, smack. Don't be shy. Harder. Harder. Come on, you can do it. Smack it. Smack it. And just like that, all of the rotors are now changed. This looks so good. Now we can 100% say that these TEs 
look amazing on some nice drilled and slotted rotors from R1 Concepts. What do you think, honey? <laughs> it looks good. Uh, Shirley did it. We're going to make sure right now that we don't die because uh, Shirley's first time changing her brakes and rotors. Very big part of the car. Let's make sure we don't <laughs> not have any braking power. Okay, test number one for your new brakes. Keep driving, driving, driving. Now, oh my God, someone jumped in front of you. Hit your brakes. <laughs> oh, how do they feel? Good. Pretty nice, <laughs> huh? Okay, we keep driving. All right, warm up your tires like we're in F1. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, oh, tire warm up. Let's go. She knows, she knows. We're warming up the tires, let's go. Oh my God, babe, a kid just jumped in front of you. Hit your brakes. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So the brakes are working. Now let's try your parking brake. Um, keep it in drive. Put your emergency brake on. Let go of it. Did we start rolling back? No. So okay. So it looks like our parking brake, emergency brake, is working good. Okay. Put it back and let's go home. Right there, we can see a really good shot of how these drilled and slotted rotors look on the. I was gonna say the FD, but no, this is a Corolla. Whoops. Sheesh. Dude, her car looks so good, dude. I don't know why she sleeps on her own car. Look how badass that looks. And now those drilled and slotted rotors, they look killer. That's what I'm talking about. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. My leg is pretty painful, but we did some cool stuff. If you guys need any kind of anime tattoos, I know they could do some other stuff, but they specialize in anime. So I'm going to say, if you guys want anime tattoos and you're here in SoCal, hit up King's Inc. Paola, thank you so much. You absolutely killed the tattoo. Shout out to R1 Concepts for sending me over some drilled and slotted rotors for Shirley. Definitely completed her car with these drilled and slotted rotors. And they look chef's kiss. All of my cars have drilled and slotted rotors from R1 Concepts. And I absolutely love them. And I think I'm going to add some um rotors from r1 concepts and some brake pads for my mom and her audi um in the near future so thank you guys for watching the video i hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys hit the like button and subscribe as always i wish you nothing but positivity and good energy till next time peace